Hey guys, Joe Cap House here, and today I'm going to be talking about a new video. So, this is going to be sort of like my very first, well, my very first, um, I guess you could say, impressions video. And that is my impressions on this little bad boy here. You know, the NX. This is totally NX. See, these are the Joy-Cons, and this is the, 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 the whatever. I don't know, people call it tablet, I don't know, I don't know I think, I'm pretty sure the official name, but we don't know that yet. Anyways, we're gonna talk about the Nintendo Switch. The Nintendo Switch, if those who don't know, in the gist, is basically a um, a basically Nintendo's next system. It's revealed uh, a week from recording this video, and uh, it's very interesting. It seems to mix mishmash the elements of console and handheld, and this is freaking hyped up. In fact, it's so hyped up that Nintendo stock went up to one billion dollars at the reveal last night. It's crazy. So, um, yeah. Normally, I would, like, normally this is where most YouTubers, like, just go into the trailer, just keep going, analyzing it bit by bit, but I don't really have the software to do that. So, in the, so I'll just put it, I'll just put the trailer in it like this. <gasps> ready? Good? You good, guys? Okay, ready. Basically, this guy is a man. This guy has a Nintendo Switch. He's playing the Zelda Breath of the Wild. Doc uh, does the thing. He gets the Joy Cons. Let me use this way, whatever. And then they, and then basically he just gets in front of the thing. Then he goes outside, plays the dog. You know, still plays, still plays Zelda. Later on, he goes to the airport, probably going to Mexico. And then he, you know, uh, gets a girl. You know, they just play it together. And then you know, in the airport, just plays Skyrim. And in the car, just plays Skyrim, 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 Skyrim. And you know, you, you know, after that, you know, after that, after that, after you, you know. You know, the usual, the usual stuff, stuff, you know, you know, after, after that scene, you know, after that scene, after that mm, giant scene, you know, after that, there's these guys going in the car, you know, you know, they're playing, they're playing Mario Kart, you know, in the Switch, yay, 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 King Boot for the win, you know, you know, they go actual cold car, awesome, awesome, they, they do the Switch logo thing again. You know, after that, like, uh, there's, like, these guys playing NBA, you know, after, like, a long game of basketball and after drink the water and Gatorade, whatever, whatever you call it, blah, 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 switch, you know, and then this girl playing the new Mario game with a Mexican place and a desert place, and then this guy goes to the apartment and does a switch thing again, and then, he, he, you know, just plays, and then, and this guy's like, wow, I really need this thing, I'm making an incredible thing in my life, oh my god, switch, you know, and then in the last part, you know, Splatoon, Splatoon on the switch, the best thing. Ever in my life, holy crap! And then you know, just play, you know, battle, you know, strategic. Okay, where should I swag here? Where should I swag? And then they just do a giant tournament, you know, you know, because because we can't show Smash Brothers yet, because they're probably in there, and they're probably gonna include Shrek and Steve, you know, you know, and they probably do that, and then just battle to the death, and then just kill them, and then switch. So that's basically the trailer in the hole. No, I'm being serious right now. Link is scripted below for the trailer if you really want to watch it. You probably did watch it if you like this channel. Probably. But if you still didn't, I'll leave it in the link screen below. Because I'm nice. So that's basically the gist of it. You know. You know, that's the gist of it, you know. So what about... You know, you're probably wondering, what's my impressions, you know? My impressions that, like, my general impressions that I am very surprised and very, very excited. Like most people. This is a very interesting console. I mean, like, we've known it for NX for so long. All the leaks, you know, all the things. You know, everything's piecing together, you know? And while there are some rumors that, like, could hold it back, like, a uh, rumor on a mediocre battery life... I still think it could be a very successful system. Not to mention all of the third party supporters that are going to be supporting this thing it is ridiculous. I would like to list them off, but in a gist. Nintendo, why the crap did you not end? Just, it's fantastic, you know. But I do have some questions. First up, in one of the trailers, they show that Amiibo support. I know I didn't include that, but there's no way I'm gonna do that. I'm not gonna try. I'm gonna try as close as possible. But 
yeah, at one point during the girl portion with like the girl and playing Mario portion, they show the Mario amiibos. Now, this includes some couple things. Now, you know, the Mario amiibos, you know, the Mario amiibos, like, you know, they show the amiibos. Now, Nintendo has already confirmed that like the that like amiibos will stay for now and some games will support it. The thing is, all the amiibos shown there were from the Super Mario series and it was during the Mario game portion. So, this probably means that the new Mario game will have amiibo support. And uh, hopefully some other games. Hopefully Mario Kart will keep that amiibo support. Hopefully Splatoon will keep the amiibo support. And the usual. Blah, 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 blah. Also, also, is a very interesting thing. And uh, another thing I want to mention, this is the other thing, is the game cards. Now, I actually have a 3DS game card in comparison because a lot of people are saying that this looks, that the new game cards that are going to be, like the new cartridges, are look very similar to the 3DS cartridges. Yes, they are no longer using disc anymore for this system, at least for this system. They might just switch back during the next, who knows, they could switch back in the next system. But as you hear, this is my, this is a 3DS card, it's Hyrule Warriors Legends. You know, this is pretty thin, you know, pretty thin, you know, square shaped, you know, not that tall, you know, equal sides. You know, now, judging by like the trailers and images shown, uh, given by Nintendo, it seems in a gist that like, that the, that, the, that the little cartridges will be similar to the 3DS, except it will be a bit, a bit bigger, a bit taller, and a bit thinner, maybe, and that's the gist of it. Um, probably, eat, we're not sure, like, they'll be the same color. What we do, what, what a big question does this bring is that, what will the cartridges be? Like, we all know that the Wii U cartridge is the same as any console cartridge, you know? But, like, with such small divide cartridges like do you really need a box that big like seriously do you really need a box that big maybe skyrim will have a box that big because they did reveal skyrim in the trailer and you know you, you know but other than that that's like what the like what the crap is going on here like this makes no sense but yeah now the now i do have one concern with all the hype i do have one concern nintendo if you're watching this video which is like out of this world no please make there be a way to like transfer the data from the old mario kart and splatoon to the new one because there's no way in the in the world of a freaking a freaking uh, in the world of, of splatting people and racing people and king boo and whatever and everything nintendo am i gonna get a level 43 again no there's no way no no i'm not doing it i'm not doing it that's that's too much grind it's too much too much! Anyways, that's pretty much what I have for today, but before I go, I want to mention something. Now, recently, Pokemon Go released a new update for the game. Well, not really an update, it's more of a very first event. Now, from, from today, from the day I'm recording this video, which is October 26th, through November 1st, you will be able to, you'll be able to get a new Halloween, to participate in the new Halloween event, assuming you're playing. So, what does this event contain? Well, you probably already know at this point, but still, but just for a recap, what this will contain is that the Zubat, Drowsy, and Ghastly lines will have an increase in counter rate, meaning it's easier to get a Gengar or, or Hypno. No way in heck you're going to waste that time for Zubats. Don't even try to catch them. And, uh, yeah, you know, that's the usual. And also another thing is that they add in... They made it to where, during that time, you get double candy for everything. So, when you capture a Pokemon, instead of giving you three candy, you get six candy. When you transfer a Pokemon, instead of getting uh, one candy, you get two candy. And, when you get a buddy Pokemon, when you use a buddy Pokemon, instead of walking one kilometer, you have to walk 0 0.25 kilometers. If you want, if you walk uh, three kilometers, and you, if it's three kilometers, then you just have to walk 0 0.75 kilometers. And if it's five kilometers, then you only have to walk 1.25 kilometers. Basically a four times boost. So this is a very interesting update. Unfortunately, I haven't messed with it yet. I still need to mess with it out. I need to do it ASAP. But I hope you guys, this will be very beneficial to me. Especially for Gengar, because I recently got a Haunter. But without further ado, guys, thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. See you guys next time.